this is gonna cost us big. Yeah. Look at this. We're in a pickle. We don't have a spare. All right, guys, so getting the tire changed out right now. Thankfully, it didn't um, do too much damage underneath. Another thing, when you're broken down, always have this kind of a kit in your car. A vest, high visibility vest. It helps at night too, it has reflective tape on it and it's bright so people can see us. If I was able to pull off enough and we're safe on the one side of the trailer here. But right, let me show you the damage that was done. So thankfully no damage was done underneath or to the side or anything like that and super super lucky but we're in a pickle we don't have a spare so that's one of those things that we just neglected to get before we started going we were just doing local trips here and there so we thought we'd be okay and it's not so we got some friends thankfully we have friends here um, they got a floor jack and they're gonna help us uh, limp this thing along. We're gonna get, they're bringing a tire for us and we're gonna get it off the road here. Um, all over to safety, we're only about five or so miles away from our house. We're gonna get this thing changed out. And like I said, thankfully no more, no other damage was done. We're still stranded on the side of the highway, but we just wanted to give you some information about what to do, what not to do, and what you should be prepared for. One thing we realized was we knew we didn't have a spare tire for the RV. Kind of knew that the tires were getting down there, um, but since we were doing just short drives, we thought that we would be okay. Well, don't ever take things for granted. Don't, nope. don't take chances. It's not worth it. Nope. This is gonna cost us big. Yeah. Like I said before, make sure that you have a little emergency kit. Um, we don't have the cones, but make sure that you have, you know, flashes on, stuff like that. You're being safe. Pull over to the side of the road as far as you can, um, just to be safe as well. Call roadside assistance, whatever you need to do. Call friends if you can. So and we just talked to roadside assistance actually, and uh, we thought they were going to be another hour out um, right before they called and then the guy called it sounds like he's a couple minutes away so thankfully um, someone's coming to help us quicker than we thought yep. which is good but um, yeah like Daniel said just always <clears throat> be cautious and always be ready for anything all right guys so we went to a 24-hour place uh, that sells tires a friend helped me out with going to the place and then we got the tire put on and then we put the tire back on the trailer got it off the side of the road we got our trailer off to the side as you can see and um, it, that's just a temporary fix but make sure that you have a spare let me tell you you don't want to go through that headache of not having a spare not having anything even a jack um, make sure you have a jack make sure you have all those tips that's it for this video thanks for watching i hope you got some value out of this video if you did make sure you smash that like button leave a comment down below what you liked if you got any value out of this video as well and also if you haven't done so already hit that subscribe button it's free and it helps us out